The Kinesi Max Adjustable Bridge. Performance by design. When designing the Kinesi Max harness, DMM and Tree Imagineers set out to create a resilient adjustable bridge system, ensuring that the components are compatible with one another and that their performance exceeds the requirements for SIT harness certification. Rope bridge construction consists of a Dyneema core, a fluffy intermediate polyester sheath, and an extra thick polyester cover or wear sleeve. The adjuster has been designed with this rope construction in mind, leaving a channel for the load bearing core. If the cams were ever to close completely, they will not sever the core. DMM has conducted some very demanding tests on the rope bridges and the adjuster beyond what is required for the SIT harness certification. We'd like to share those results with you here. First is a cyclic loading test to four kilonewtons. The cam is clamping on the rope in the exact same spot through the entirety of the test. Here we have the results from 100 cycles and 1,000 cycles. The rope is visibly flattened. However, there is little to no fiber damage and the core is also undamaged. A drop test was also performed. The rope bridge and adjuster are set on a jig and connected via a steel lanyard. The total mass, including all components, is 155 kilograms. As the drop occurs, we can see chunks taken out of the cover as energy is dissipated, ending at the stopper knot. The core is undamaged. Bridges from the cyclic and drop tests are then tensioned to 15 kilonewtons for three minutes. This is a common test across many harness certifications. Notice that the cover has separated, the core is intact, and the stopper knot with stiffener is jammed against the adjuster body. This illustrates the importance of having the stopper knot in place along with the stiffener stitching at the end of the tail. The core's integrity and strength has been maintained throughout all of these very demanding tests. Finally, the bridge is pulled to destruction and the core breaks at the inside of the stopper knot. Residual strength in all cases is greater than 30 kN. With these results, we can see that the system is capable of handling a force much greater than would be seen in normal use, or what is required in certification testing. In summary, two series of tests were conducted on the rope bridges. One series began with cyclic loading, followed by 15 kN for three minutes, and ending with a pull to destruction. The other series began with a dynamic drop followed by 15 kN for three minutes and also ending in a pull to destruction. Both series of tests yielded a residual strength greater than 30 kN. DMM and Tree Imagineers have created a resilient adjustable bridge system through a performance by design approach using intentionally selected materials and compatible, thoughtfully designed components. To learn more about the Kinesi Max Harness, visit our website at dmmwales.com.